Hello guys, I hope you all are doing great. As I started a channel on network security and cloud, what are the various global certifications which I did. So today I'm going to discuss one of the most recognized certifications from EC Council, where there's a lot of demand nowadays for threat analysis. So we'll discuss on certified threat intelligent analysis. So how you can become CDI expert and what is the content which we have. So let's discuss this certification, how I did my CTI, sharing my screen here. Now, if we talk about CTIA, I am certified EC Council instructor, CEI, and I'm also certified threat intelligent analyst. So this is our CTIA, how I did my CTIA global certification from EC Council. Now, if you look at the course content, these are six modules, introduction to threat intelligence, then you have cyber threat and kill chain methodology, requirements, planning, direction, and review, if you want to design your own CTIA. And then what is data collection, what is processing, data analysis, and intelligence reporting and dissemination. This is you know when you'll be sharing it with others. So officially, this would be three days training, 9 a.m. till 5 p.m., 24 hours. And we have a lot of labs here in this fourth module, fifth and sixth, I guess like approx 14 labs here, maybe three, four labs here and three, four labs here as per the official content. So if we talk about the exam, certified threat intelligence analyst, this is the exam code 31285. There are 50 questions which we need to answer in two hours. And this is available in EC Council exam portal. So for all the EC Council exams, we need to register at EC Council exam portal. We also need to uh, create a profile at Aspen portal where we can download all the content. This is our passing score. So if I talk about planning this exam, now EC Council will give you access to the PDF and all the labs if you want to design your own lab, or you can also get access to the official lab, which is iLab from EC Council. And if we plan it, so I would say six days to go through the course content, maybe one module per day. If you want to understand all the techniques here, then you know it might take six days or one week to go through the content, four days to go through a lab, three days to go through practice questions and three days to revise. So I would say six plus four, 10, three plus three. So it's approximately three weeks, two or three weeks. I would say minimum three weeks is the time you need to spend to pass this exam. Again, sources are similar. You go to VC plus, you go to IT exams, you go to exam topics or you go to YouTube. And you can find some practice questions. So this is into threat analysis. I do see a lot of demand for the certification where you will have an overview on how you do threat analysis. Because if you work as a SOC analyst, you are supposed to do threat anal uh, intelligence. You are supposed to do incident handling. You should do uh, you know all other things, forcing investigation. So this is a link which is available here. And that is the latest version. So if you go and search for the brochure, you'll be able to find it. I'll try to see if I can include this, that, this in the description. So that is it about this certification. Now, this is how I plan my certification, only three days to cover the course content and to do these all these labs. And then you can write your exam to get certified. You can also do a little bit practice because these are some multiple choice questions. It's going to help you a lot if you work as a forensic investigator, if you work in threat analysis, if you work as a SOC analyst, CTI is one of the good certification from EC Council when it comes to threat analysis. So I'll see you in some other video. With this, I'm going to end it. Please do like, subscribe, comment, and share this channel. It's not that old. I've just started it. So I'll be coming up with some nice topics. Thank you.